What is going on, YouTube? We are back with another video, and today we are going to be doing a look at the Rinky case lineup for the Galaxy Z Fold 6. Now, shout out to Rinky for sending this out to me. I just took possession of it and wanted to go ahead and get this video recorded ASAP for you guys out there. So, of course, as you can see, this is a review kit from Rinky. And, of course, we have a little thing here inside from Rinky. A little nice little card that they always send out. Shout out to Rinky, man. Rinky really takes care of the creators that support them. So, it's always nice to see this here. And let's go on ahead and take a look and see what we got inside. Ripping open this, we have a lens frame for the uh, cameras on the Z Fold 6. We also have what looks like the Fusion Clear Case. We also have a cover display, tempered glass screen protector, and we even have a dual easy film screen protector for the inner display. Now, I'll probably do a separate video on this just because I have never done a screen protector for the inner display of the fold. So I'm a little nervous about that, but we're going to do a separate video on this one and get to this one later. But I'm going to put it off to the side for now. And in this video, we're going to dive into this case. And like I said, we'll get into this also in another video. So stay tuned for that. But getting into this case real quick, as you can see, Rinky didn't really do too much this year with the case lineup. We really just have the Fusion Clear. There's also one that has MagSafe on the back of it. So for those of you Android MagSafe users, that is an option out there for you. But as you can see on the box, first rate quality, detailed design, safe material. And that's pretty much going to be it. So let's go on ahead and pop this thing open. And let's see what this case is going to look like. Now, Rinky cases have always been great cases when it comes to the fold lineup simply because of their thinness and the actual like how they actually adhere to the phone rinky cases have always been solid so as you can see on the inside we have our protective film removal guide so there is a protective film on the inside here and that is basically just there to make sure that you know you don't have any dust or anything on the inside once you put your phone on now one thing that i do like this year about the cases, if you guys can see it on camera here, see if I can show you, there's a little bit of plastic there, but it has a little bit of a flex, and that's gonna actually help keep the case on and make sure that when it snaps back, it is like fully snapped back onto your phone. So that's actually really cool. I think that's really nice. I would love to see them just actually do a full-blown hinge protection, kind of like a speaking case, but for now, this is going to do. So let's go on ahead and try it on. I'm not going to peel this off just yet because I'm going to use this case, but I want to wait until I've done a few other videos before I do that. So we're going to just try it on the phone and we're going to see how it looks. I'm going to open my phone up first, unlock the phone, and we're going to just go in just like this. We're going to do the back piece first. So slide that in and then we'll also just go on ahead and bring it around the front. And I'm going to try to close it here and see how it looks. And this is what it's going to look like on your Galaxy Z Fold 6. Now, I'm going to wipe my phone off real quick off camera just because it is a little, there's a lot on the screen. And I do have the Samsung anti-reflective screen protector on here. And as I can see on here on the phone, there is no issue whatsoever. So the screen protector is still on just fine. And like I said, I do still have some of the tape on because I didn't take all of it off for the adhesive on the back and on the front. But just looking around the overall case, this is actually really nice. It's a very thin, very minimal case. As you can see, it does not add hardly any bulk to the phone, but you do get some corner protection. There is like a little bit of an air pocket in those corners. You have a spot down here for your lanyard, if you guys can tell. Also, USB-C ports pretty wide, so you can use one of those oversized chargers if you have one. Opens and closes with the phone just fine. I don't feel any resistance. I do like the fact that if you guys can tell, there is a there is a there's texture on the up and down for the volume, so that is a nice touch. Does feel good. One thing about this type of case that I like is the fact that it doesn't even feel like there's a case on the phone. So that's obviously going to be something really nice when you're using a case. I definitely think that if you're looking for a good case for your phone, uh, your Z Fold 6, you can't go wrong with the Rinky case, man. These cases are solid. They're inexpensive. This case is very, very cheap. And there's even, no, there's not, no, there's not really. I was trying to see if there was, but there's no lay on the table protection with this case. So just keep that in mind. But there is on the front display. So the front display does have 
um, layover protection. So you can put it down and not have to worry about anything. But either way, this is going to be the Rinky Fusion Clear for the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 6. And as I said, I will be doing a separate review on the tempered glass screen protector and on the dual easy film. So stay tuned for those videos. But in the meantime, I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Make sure you drop a comment down below and I will catch you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.